On table four, it's the women's class six to ten bronze medal match. Representing Poland, Natalia Partika. Alicia Eigner. Karolina Peck. Malgozata Jankowska. Representing France, Claire Marie. Audrey Lamorvan. Anne Bonu. And Thu Kamkasomfu. Your umpire is Nagako Tamura from Japan and the assistant umpire is Safi Satur from India. On table two, it is the women's class six to ten gold medal match. Representing Turkey, Kubra Okshoy, Neslahan Kavas, and Umran Ursis. Representing the People's Republic of China, Leilina. Fan Lei, Liu Mei Li, and Yang Qian. Your umpire is Gamal Abdel Nasser from Egypt, and the assistant umpire is Jackie Williams from Great Britain. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the women's team bronze and gold medal matches at the London 2012 Paralympic Games. So fighting it out for the bronze this morning are France and Poland on table four. Plenty of quality in both teams. Keep an eye out for France's Du Kamkasomfu. She won gold in the singles at the Beijing Paralympics in 2008 and is the Class 8 world number one. As for Poland, they have Natalia Partika in their team, the world number one and also a gold medal winner already in the singles here in London. And watch out for Karolina Peck competing here at just 14 years of age. Our gold medal match pitches the People's Republic of China against Turkey. Leili Na is the world number one and took gold earlier this week in the Class 9 singles at London 2012. Liu Mei Li and Fan Lei both world number twos. As for Turkey, will they provide stern opposition in Kubra Okshoy and Neslihan Kavas? They have two world number threes competing this morning. Now, don't forget, if you want to follow our big screen match in even more detail, you can. There's live in-ear commentary available from former British Paralympian and all-round legend Farrell Anthony. Just purchase a headset, they cost £5 and are available from any of our programme sellers. 
An important reminder now, as a courtesy to our athletes on this most important of days, flash photography is not permitted inside this arena. So everything to play for, ladies and gentlemen. Bronze, silver and gold medals up for grabs. Put your hands together, make some noise. If you brought a flag, lift it up. Let's hear it for our athletes. It is the London 2012 Paralympic Games. Gentlemen, my name's Farrell Anthony. I am your in-ear commentator for this gold medal class six to ten match between China and Turkey. Players on court at the moment are Li Linar from China and Oshkoy from Turkey. Both these players are left-handed. Oscar serves. Just misses One that old. there. Just uh, went away a bit into the net. Early stage of this match. One all. Leilin our serves. One. Great serve there. Came round the ball, but came underneath it as well to impart backspin. And again, the same thing. So she now leads 3-1. Three, three, Oscoid serve. Great play from Oscoid there. Just controlling the play with her backhand. And that's a great reply from well, Lee there. <laughs> Playing wide into the left-handers back uh, forehand side and she now takes a 4-2 lead and again Oskoy she's struggling with that's three serves in a row she struggled with to put them all in the net and that's brilliant from Oskoy a lot better um, returning well now Oskoy to serve Serves into the middle. Three, six. And then tries to return. Now you'll probably see that um, Oskoy, she's actually got pimples on her backhand side, which neutralises spin. Seven, three. And what happens is when um, there's heavy spin on the ball, the, the pimples actually neutralise the spin, so the ball goes back a bit slower. Lee now leads, Eight and again Oscoy putting the ball into that. She's not got the, the measure of these serves yet, and again she's struggling to that backhand. She needs to change the tactics a bit, so she serves down the middle, and again that's a strong, strong forehand Four from Lee. Nine. But Oscoy was covered very well, and it's Lee who misses the table. Oskoy with one serve to come. Fast serve. Oh, and that's brilliant top Simple. spin from Lee. Playing down the line, but heavy. Tossed the ball up with a lot of spin there. And now it's 10-4 in front, game point. And again, Oskoy, she's missed five serves in a row. And um, you can't at this level, you can't afford to give five serves away. And... China take that first game 11 4. So both players have gone back to their uh, respective corners for um, some guidance and advice. And uh, they're allowed to take on some fluids, and they'll be chatting to their coaches about the um, the tactics it needs to employ. I think Lee will be the more relaxed. 11-4 uh, 
and she wasn't really troubled by Os Oskoy then. Um, Oskoy missed five serves. Second game, lead the serves. Love all. Okay. Oxlade Dane with a fantastic backhand punch. Lead to serve. One all. So it's Oskoy to serve. She serves forehand. And then it's a forehand one, down the diagonal from Lee. She now leads 2-1. So he serves down the middle. Three, one. And a heavy spin from Lee there, and she now leads 3 1. Four, one. Great attacking from Lee there. She's very strong on the forehand and backhand, but she's using her forehand to great effect here. Great serves, very strong. One, five. And again, Oxoy just missing that ball not being able to cope with the serve she now trails 5-1 great serve there with backspin from Oxoy and again the heavy spin from Lee she's, she's struggling to cope she's not really got into the game and Lee's got out of the blocks really well And there's a timeout being called by the Turkish coach who tries to give his players some encouragement. He realises that she's not in the game at the moment and um, she called the timeout early. Uh, timeouts are allowed by one timeout per player per every five game match. And um, because they can only use one, um, it's very important that they use it at the right time. Six two. So lead to serve. Seven two. Just serving into the middle of the table there. Oxide missing the ball. And again, very quick hands from Lee. Ball's being returned now from she's got the measure of the serve, but Lee's so quick. And then a miss from Oxoy and it's it's going away from the Turkish girl slightly. Lee in command. And a first miss, unforced error from Lee there. She now leads 9-3, but she has two serves to come. She serves cross court into the backhand. It's returned from Oxoy, but then um, she's net from Oxoy. So it's now 10-3. And a great return from Oxkoy there. A top spin cross court from Lee. But Oxkoy returning it with interest. But trails 10 4. Five, ten. And it's into the net from Oxoy there, so 11-5. So after taking the first game, 11-4, Lee takes now the second game, 11-5. As well, the players go back to the tables, back to the coaches, just to get um, some fluid. Turkish coach explaining to his player what he wants her to do, in, and he's actually very forcefully making the point and he's asking her to build up some energy giving her to, asking her to jump on her toes or something just say get get something moving because in the moment Lee's running away with this match so it will be Oxoy to serve Love 
And again, she's missed that ball. Not really settled. And again, a heavy topspin from Lee. She now takes a 2-1, two 2-0 two lead. Then serves off. Try to serve down the line there, just taking a, t a different angle on the serve. And again, Oxley just missing that forehand topspin. And it's now 3 1 to Lee. Oxley to serve. She serves cross court and it's a backhand top spin from, from Lee. One and ball. then a backhand miss from Oxoy. So she now trails 4 1. Oxoy to serve. She serves down the diagonal. And she wins that. She wins that point. Oxoy just put in a um, great top spin on the ball there. It's now Lee from China to serve. She serves cross court. And that's better from Oxoy. Attacking that ball rather than being passive with it. So will Lee do the same serve? She does. And it's up again. And it's heavy spin. And another heavy spin. And Oxoy just failing to get the ball. And there's a, there's a clap of approval from the Chinese bench. And then Oxoy just nets, and it's now 6-3 to Lee from China. Oxoy to serve. She serves cross court, and it's back cross court, and a heavy top spin from Lee. Cross court into the Oxoy back forehand, and that's a winner. And so she now leads 7-3. Lee to serve. So again, it's cross court. And Oh, and it's a Oxoy just playing that ball, trying to play it wide, and she just missed. And nothing is going right for the girl from Turkey at the moment. It's 8-3 to Lee. Serves cross court again. It's a heavy top spin. She's not having to do much to win the points, is Lee. She's she's got a game plan, and and it's working very well. Oxoy to serve. Again, heavy back, but she's, she's lifting it with heavy spin. And Oxley is struggling, and it's now 10-3. She's got seven game points. Ten Oxley four. just, uh, just apologising for the, the net there. But she still trails by 10-4. With lead to serve. She serves on the diagonal and then it's Game netted five. from Oxoy. Lee to serve again. Six. And now she's started to relax. She's 10 6 down and the Turkish coach and the players are clapping. And she's now won three points in a row. And because she's down, she's probably relaxing, thinking she's got nothing to lose. And that generally happens with players who are behind. And again, another another point won by Oxoy, and it's now 10-7. So from she's actually saved four game points, and she serves again. It's down the middle this time, but then it's off, and that's it. Lee from China wins the third game, 11-7, and takes China into a one-nil lead in this gold medal match. She wins 11-4, 11-5, 11 My name is Farrell Anthony. I've been your inner commentator for this match and we'll be back for the second game shortly.
Right, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name's Farrell Anthony. I'm your in commentator for this class six to ten match, women standing for China versus Turkey. China taking an early one nil lead, and on court now we have Fan Li from the People's Republic of China, the world ranked number two, and the. Women's singles, class 10, bronze well win winner. Um, and she will play. Neslihan Kavas from Turkey, the world ranked number three player in class nine. And she won the silver medal in London 2012. Both players are right handed players play very strong the um, Kavas has a traditional grip but Lee plays with a pen hold grip which is predominantly used by Asian players um, it means they can use their wrist a bit more but generally um, before they used to play a lot of forehands, forehand on, but now they play backhand. The referee's called order, and it will be Cavas to serve. She serves into the backhand of a fan and, and, and leads 1 0. It's a backhand serve. It's up in the air, and, and then brilliant from Cavas. She's pinned it already, you can see the tactics to pin. Fan into the backhand. Fan serves. And that's a great serve. Using a wrist to great effect and put side spin and top spin on the ball. The ball popped up and she put it away with, with ease. Then she serves. And then she came round the same action, but she came underneath the ball and created backspin. And that's why it went into the bottom of the net. Cavas there, just trying to go for a backhand topspin, but just missed. But Cavas to serve. She serves into the forehand of Lee, short, and it's a great serve from Cavas. As she prepares, steely-eyed. Very strong on both wings. Fan to serve. She serves short into the forehand, and Cavas tried to flick that ball away, but there was backspin on the ball, so it went into the net. Again, Fan serving, and that's a great. Oh, and that's brilliant play from Fan. It was so quick. She played a backhand into the backhand of Cavas, and then she played a forehand into the same backhand, but really quickly. So now she takes a 5-3 lead. And Cavas there, just the serve popped up. What she did was she tried to come around the ball and down on the ball to create backspin, but she just missed hit it, so the ball popped up, and that's why it was easier put away for Fan. And again, Fan just missing. She played a, the, the the serve was loose, and Cavas just just managed to block the ball on, but she still trails six four. Brilliant backspin from Cavas. Took the ball early, used her wrist to generate more spin. Lee leads 6 5. Oh, and that's brilliant from Cavas again. Unlike Oxoy, she's really into this match. She started early, a great start. So now she's going to serve. She serves into the backhand of Fan. And then Fan puts it off the end, and it's now 7 6 to Cavas. And again, brilliant from. Played it short into the Fan forehand, and she flicked it off the, off the end. And now it's Lee Cav um, Fan to serve, I'm sorry. Oh, that's brilliant from Cavas. Two forehands into the forehand of Fan, and then a backhand and a forehand to win. Brilliant combination play. Six. 
And again, Chavas' backhand is very strong, probably stronger than a forehand. And Fan has played into a strength. So now, Cavas leads 10 6. And that was better from Fan. Got over the ball with the flick. The ball popped up, and then she was very strong in with the forehand. But she still trails by 10 points to 7. Oh, and brilliant from Cavas. She takes that first game. Fan scratching her head as she goes back to the corner. And both players going back to their coaches for one minute of inspiration where they can get some water and listen intently to what their coaches have to say about match tactics. I suspect that the Turkish coach will be happy with that performance. Kavas has come out of the blocks really quickly to impose herself on this uh, match and she took the first game 11-7 so both girls Kavas just going back and taking a drink of water just to explain this team event it's a class 6 to 10 team event um, so all combinations of um, disability mobility are included fan is a class 10 and Kavas is a class 9 but both at the top of their world rankings due to their ability to play the game Fan to serve. And it's off the end from Fan there. Oh, and again, Cavas, great combination play. Backhand, quick into the backhand of Fan. And then a forehand wide, very quickly. Oh, and Fan there, a long serve from Cavas with nothing on. It wasn't really, it wasn't fast, it wasn't slow, it was just medium paced. And Fan capitalising to reduce the deficit to 2-1. Oh, and now that's brilliant. Both players playing top spins into, from the forehand side into the backhand side. But it's Fan who takes that point and now it's 2 all. Oh, and then what happened was she played with topspin but kept the ball short. So Cavas couldn't get. When she played the ball, she actually, it actually kicked off the end of the table. Fan to serve again. She leads 3-2. It's short again. And again, the mistake coming from Cavas. I think Lee's learned very quickly to keep that ball short to the Cavas backhand if she's going to serve there because Cavas is very strong. Cavas, she's going to serve a backhand. And she serves it into the forehand of Lee. Very short. Lee, fan, sorry, tried to flick the ball. But because it was short, she just clipped the net. And that's a great return from Fan. Playing it wider into the backhand of Cavas, who struggled to get the ball and time it. So now Fan leading 5-3. She serves short again. And it pops up and then... Cavas, she tried, there was nothing on that ball, it was a float ball, and she tried to pick it up with topspin, but it went off the end. Fan now leads 6 3. And brilliant from Lee there, fast into the backhand of Cavas, but she played it with backspin, which was the most important thing, and Cavas failed to lift the ball. And again, that serve just drifting long. There's not much. It's not fast. It's not slow. It's into the hitting zone for Fan. And now she leads 8-3. And again, heavy push from Fan. And so now she's got into the match. She's 9-3 in front. She is going to serve. She serves into the backhand of Cavas. And that was long. And, it, and Cavas spun it up. And, but it went... Um, the way of 
Fan. Fan. Seven game points. Brilliant. Top spin. Take and flip from Cavas into the middle. So she now trails 10 4. She's going to serve backhand into the forehand of Lee. It's heavy top spin from Fan, but then a counter top spin from Cavas. A very difficult skill, but she executed that well. Cavas again serving. She's going to serve backhand. She serves into the backhand of Lee, and now brilliant combination from Cavas. Brilliant. She played. She got a top spin back down the line from Fan, who tried to change the play, but Cavas then played it into the open court wide to Fan's forehand. So now China lead 10-6. Fan to serve. Oh, and she's missed it. The ball popped up. And Cavas just doing what what most players do in a situation, just retrieve the ball. And so she saved four game points and Fan now just taking herself, just wiping her bat with the hand, giving her a bit more time and bouncing the ball on the table, then on her bat. And now she serves. It's a flick from Cavas, but the return from Fan was brilliant. And so it was 11-7 that Fan wins that game. So this game evenly poised as Fan from China wins that 11-7 and her coach is pointing at her she um, just obviously giving her some guidance on what she should have been doing all the time and maybe she might have taken the first game but Cavas in that second game wasn't as effective she was playing too many balls serves that were just nice serves to hit so they weren't fast they weren't slow and Fan was able to capitalise on that So as they just review a few points on screen, um, some of the key points in that game, um, it's now one game all. And as we, the players will come back to the table for the third game, which will probably prove crucial in this game um, in terms of confidence. Both players come back to the table. Uh, just um, adjusting to towels and things. And it will be, it will be Cavas to serve. Third game, to serve In this crucial third game of the first, second match, Cavas serves backhand. Brilliant forehand topspin from Fan, but a better one from Cavas, and she takes that first point. Again, all oh right, she's going to a forehand now. Into the backhand. And then she tried to do what she did in the first game and heavy topspin, but she just tried to use too much of the angle and misses. So now it's fun to serve. She serves into the backhand of Lee and then punches that ball away. She was expecting that. She knows that Cavas very rarely goes down the line with her backhand, so she can prepare for that ball coming back. Again, it's into the backhand, and now there's a push from Cavas. Oh, and that was brilliant from Cavas, because she went down the line. And that's the first time in the match she's gone down the line. She's giving some, some fans something to think about. So she serves. Heavy top spin, and then down the line again. And then cross court, and then down the line, but it's cross court from Fan. Brilliant play from both players. And it seems, to, to me, it seems like both players are actually thinking about where they're putting the ball now. Cavas to serve. She serves into the backhand and then into the middle. But Fan just fantastic. Moved her feet, moved her body and played a forehand down the line for a winner. And the Turkish bench just clapping um, Cavas for encouragement. And it's Fan to serve. She serves short to the forehand and it's flicked away. And there could be a timeout called here. It's 5-2. And there is a timeout called. Turkish coach knows how important this is and he's called the timeout at 5 2 in favour of Fan from China. Each player allowed one timeout in a game um, consisting of five, a, a, a match consisting of five games. 
and it's very crucial that um, he thinks it's very crucial that his player doesn't let Fan from China get too far away from this match. But Fan seems to be moving her feet really well. And um, she takes the advantage. So she goes back to her coach and takes some time. Um, she's going to go, and the coach is still talking. But um, she's first back to the table, and now Cavas goes back to the table. So after that timeout, it is lead to serve. She leads 5 2. She's going to serve into the backhand of Cavas, and that was heavy backspin. Straight into the bottom of the net. Cavas didn't read that and it went into the net. So Cavas to serve. She serves long into the backhand. And that gets her the point. And so she trails 6 3 and she turns to the forehand serve into the backhand again. And then she top spins and down the line. And she comes back and it. Oh, and Lee, that was a great. She, Cavas just dollied the ball. It was a great backhand topspin, but then she was out of position. But the coach is liking that. He's on his feet. He's liking the way she's playing. So it's fun to serve. She serves in wide into the backhand and then topspins it into the middle of Cavas, who tried to play a forehand. But it's fun who wins that point. Serves. It's a flick wide and then down the line. And then she went back into the backhand. And Cavas wins that point, and so trails 8 4. Cavas to serve backhand. She serves short into the forehand, and then she topspin down the line, but but Lee equal, fan equal to that, and she plays the forehand back into the Cavas backhand. Cavas to serve. It's long, and that's the one that wins the point. Now, the thing is there, she played it with a heavy tight spin and top spin very quickly. It came on fan really quickly, and that's why she missed the ball. So, fan to serve. She served short into the forehand, and then it's into the backhand of Cavas, and it came very quickly, and she couldn't get her back up enough, and she now trails 10-5, fan with one serve to come. She serves with backspin, heavy backspin, and then a heavy topspin, and Cavas missing the ball. So it Fan wins that game, 11-5. And as the players go back to the corner, lots of uh, claps of approval from this appreciative crowd. Um, but it's Fan who takes that game, 11-5, and she's got the initiative. Um, both players talking to their coaches. The Turkish coach a bit more animated with his his gestures with his hands, telling Kavas what he wants her to do. And maybe to stick to tactics. And as they go through some of the key points in that game... It's just Lee Fan who seems to be just playing just that bit better. So we come to the fourth game. And it will be Fan from China to serve to Kavas from Turkey. She's going to serve with her forehand. And she serves cross-court into the backhand and it's wide. That was a brilliant serve from Lee. Played it a lot wider so that Kavas couldn't get a topspin in. She serves again. And it's a topspin, from, but that one was easy for Kavas. She flicked it away and it's now one all. Kavas to serve. She serves... From the backhand. And she goes cross-court into the Lee backhand. And that wins her the point. And she now wins, leads 2-1. Cavas then turns to the forehand serve. But serves in, again into the backhand. It's heavy spin. And a brilliant from Lee. Now she's moving her feet. She played her backhand and was prepared to play that forehand. And it's now to all. Fan to serve.
Now serves into the backhand of Cavas, who tried to go down the line. A good decision there, but she just clipped the net. But it just shows she's still thinking about the game. Fan to serve. Again, she looks. And she serves short into the forehand. And again, that's the one that wins the point. Cavas tried to flick the ball, but it touched the net and went away. So now China lead 4-2. Cavas to serve. Serves long into the backhand. And again, Lee, very strong backhand return and a forehand winner. And it's now 5-2 and there's no more timeouts for Cavas, so she's going to have to think this one through herself. And again, just drifted long that serve. And Fan was on it like a cat. And she just played that ball really strongly. So she now leads... 6-2. Brilliant return from Cavas there. Played the ball down the line instead of cross court. And it, it just foxed Fan for a bit. Fan to serve. And again, just flicking that ball away, Fan, from a Cavas return. And now leads 7-3. Brilliant again from Cavas. He's playing that with heavy side spin and top spin. And she's gone back to that corner. She may serve short this time. No, she served long again. And brilliant from Fan. From from Cavas, I'm sorry. Fan just putting that ball off the end. There's a lot of spin being generated off that serve from Cavas now. And Fan just struggled the last couple of uh, service returns. But she serves forehand. And then Cavas spins that ball up with a bit more spin and Chinese call, Chinese call a timeout. So it's 7-6 to China. They've called a timeout. They lead 2-1 in this game. And perhaps the Chinese coach feels there's a, been a momentum shift and that Cavas has got groaning confidence. And um, she's taken the last two points and she's just telling her uh, player, giving her a couple of words of advice, using her hands to explain. Cavas just seems to come back into the match just a little bit. So with 12 seconds left on the timeout clock, both players, Cavas first, comes back to the table. Fan uses the whole of her timeout and comes back to the table. Evenly poised in this game, it's 7-6 to, to Lee. And I suspect she may serve short or long into the forehand and that's what she does she serves into the forehand and now we're into oh and Cavas just missing and now Cavas to serve she's 6-8 down it's long into the backhand and then It's a stock return for Cavas. She, she knows what's coming back. She knows it's going to come back with heavy spin. And again, she spins it heavy into the middle. Lee misses. And there's claps of approval from the Turkish Benz. Cavas now on her toes, dancing on her toes. But it is fan to serve. And she serves short into the forehand. And then the return was good from Cavas, but it was a forehand bullet down the line from Fan. Brilliant play. Took it really early and Cavas couldn't react enough. So it's 9-8 to Fan. She rolls the ball on the bat and she will serve. And this time she serves short again. And, it's, and that was brilliant from Cavas. She shows she's still thinking. Instead of going cross-court, she went back 
down the line. It's 9 all. Cav has to serve. She's going to serve backhand. She serves long and wins the point and punches the air with delight. One serve to come. Cav has to serve. She serves into the backhand and it's punched away. And again, Cavas roars with delight as she wins that point and takes the game into a fifth game. She wins that 11-9. So this game evenly poised. Very good table tennis being played by both players. And now it's going to be who can hold their metal, who can hold their nerve. Um, we've seen in the past that Cavas has played some what I would call lollipop serves where the, there's nothing on the board. It's, never, it's neither fast or slow, so it doesn't really cause the other player some problems. We've seen Lee, um, Fan just playing into the backhand and trying to force the play instead of making sure the ball goes on. Cavas very good at using a wrist to generate spin. Both players taking the full time out and taking some fluid on board as well. It's a brilliant game of table tennis. And even the, one of the Chinese players is actually giving her some words of advice as well. So not just the coach, but the player also giving her some advice. But both players are back at the table. It'll be Cavas to start at this, the third game. Sorry, fifth game. It's Cavas. She knows she's going to go into the backhand. Oh, and that was brilliant from Fan. This time she goes down the line, which is a more difficult shot. But now Cavas is going to have to think about where she plays that serve. It's a forehand serve from Cavas. And she goes into the backhand. And then it's a bit wider from Fan. She's just playing that just outside the comfort zone of a good backhand from Cavas. And now it's 2-0 to Fan. In this fifth game, great start from the Chinese player. She serves. Oh, and brilliant strong play from Fan. Playing it wide into the forehand, but Cavas got there and nearly actually got the ball on the table. 3 0 to Fan. She now serves. Short into the middle, and it's a topspin from, and that's brilliant from Cavas. This time she plays a topspin backhand into the backhand of Lee, and then plays a forehand into the same backhand that wins her the point. So it's now 3 1 to Cavas. She serves short into the backhand and then cross court. And then she, she just snatched at that ball then. The ball was there, but she just rushed it from the forehand. Again, Cav has to serve. She serves long into the middle and then it's a winner from, from Fan. She's, she's expecting that serve into the backhand so she can prepare for it. And as both players turn round, it's two all and it, and in the fifth game at the, when when the first player gets to five they change round and it's Fan who's got there in double quick time she leads five one serves into the middle and pushes wide to the oh and then gets a nice block and Cavas just reacted slowly to the return Fan leads six one rolls the ball on the back and now serves into the middle again and then heavy topspin, but a backhand from Cavas, and she's just clipped the net and she's missed. Great change of tactics from Fan here. She's not serving wide, she's serving forehand or the middle, creating bigger problems for Cavas, and she's 7 1 to the good. Cavas serves short to the backhand and then spins, and then the forehand, but it's just a forehand topspin slow into Fan, who actually loves that kind of shot. And she put it away a lot quicker and she didn't react quick enough, Cavas. Again, spinning the ball and she's just missed that ball, Fan. And it's now 2-8, but she's in control in this game. So she now is going to serve. Rolls the ball on the bat. Serves wider into the backhand. And oh, and then she's missed it. Great return from Cavas. And Fan missed the ball in the middle of the table. 
Just mistimed a stroke. But she still leads 8 3. Fan to serve. She serves into the middle. And then, brilliant, brilliant shot. She played into the middle. Kavas just playing the ball into the middle. And then she played it back into her body. And so now, Kavas to serve at 9-3. Does she have the confidence and the conviction to come back? She serves forehand into the backhand, spins it heavy, and that's a brilliant, very quick then, a quicker sort of backhand topspin, making Lee rush. And again, she's gone to the backhand. And now she serves long, and she tries to spin it down the line, the right thing to do, but it's six game points to Fan from China and she's going to serve she serves into the middle again and that's the winner brilliant tactics in the fifth game from Fan she, she was the better tactician in that game and she wins 3-2 to take China into a 2-0 lead in this best of five set match she smiles and gives high fives to all her colleagues and um, great tactician in the fifth game. She deserves to win that match. But Turkey have got an uphill struggle now. They're now 2-0 down. And it will be Fan again to, to play. And she will play against... She will play against Oskoy from Turkey. My name's Farrell Anthony, I'm your Indian commentator for this match and I'll be back shortly. So we have Lee Linar, left-handed. She is the world number one ranked class nine player. And she's playing Nestle Han Kavas. And she's the world ranked number three player. It was Lee Linar who won the gold in the class nine event. Kavas won the bronze medal. 
So on paper, it will be Lee Linata, who will actually be the strong favourite in this match. But Kava show signs in that last game against Fan from China that she's, she's a force to be reckoned with. And if she can get her tactics right, I mean, she would have played this um, Fan from uh, Lee from China quite a lot, I would have suspect, being at the top of the game. And um, she'll have the tactics. But the thing is now, she's actually playing um, a left-handed player. So the ball um, will go wide into her forehand, which isn't her strongest shot, as opposed to wide into her backhand, which is definitely Cavas' strongest shot. So again, Cavas has got to work out tactics. Um, both players just having their two-minute warm-up. Um, the player, the, the referee will put his hand up when time is signified for the two Five. minutes. And there they go. The hands have gone up. And it's Cavas who will serve in the start of this third game. Cavas serves backhand. And it's pushed. And there you go. She's missed the first forehand. She played it wide into... Lee played it wide into Cavas's forehand. And she missed. So she's gone to the forehand. And it's a push, and then a wide, and then brilliant topspin from Lee there. Heavy topspin into the backhand of Cavas, and she put the ball away um, on the, just missed the table. So Lee now, left-handed, she's going to be serving into the forehand of Cavas. And Cavas returns it on the backhand, and a brilliant return from Cavas. Played it back down the line, Lee to serve, 2-1 in front. And there was a lot of spin, although there was um, it netted. It will be Lee to serve. She serves cross court and she takes it with. And that's what I mean about Kakavas' forehand. She's not comfortable about taking it, the return on her forehand. She takes it on her backhand, and Lee wins that point. And so it's Kavas to serve backhand. She serves into the backhand of Lee very quickly. Brilliant serve. Lee not able to pick that ball up quick enough. And now she's gone to the forehand. And serves into the backhand. And then she misses the forehand. So, it's Lee to serve. She serves wide into the forehand. And it's return from Cavas. With using the backhand coming across, she's not confident about returning on a forehand at all. Lee to serve. And then what Lee did, which was brilliant there, she played a fast ball into the backhand of Cavas. Cavas expecting the ball to be served to the forehand, so she wasn't expecting it. She served short into the middle, and then a backhand from Cavas. And a forehand can start six. Cavas down the middle, but wins at the point, and now trails 6-3. Cavas to serve. It's heavy, heavy backspin from Lee there. To, Lee's a very strong player on both backhand and forehand, and she wins that point and goes 7 3 in front. So she now serves Cavas. And a forehand return from Cavas. It's into the backhand and then forehand Seven from four. Lee that just misses and now leads 7 4. And then Cavas tried four to go eight. from the middle using the backhand, but there was a lot of heavy backspin on that serve. And it went on into the net. And so Lee leads 8 4. Cavas into the backhand. Strong. And a brilliant forehand from Cavas. Also, though it's a weaker shot, she can play strong forehands. And now it's 8-5. And she goes to the backhand. And she serves it wide into the forehand. Brilliant from Cavas. Lee wasn't expecting that. So it shows that Cavas is still thinking about her game. And that's a heavy topspin from Lee. 
She served it with backspin. It came back with backspin, but she lifted it heavy. And so she leads 9-6 in this second game. Sorry, first game. Cavas focused. She turns on the backhand. It's heavy spin into the 16. middle from Lee. And Cavas returning on the backhand but misses. So now Lee leads 10-6 in this first game. Cavas to serve backhand. Serves into the backhand of Lee. And brilliant 17. from Cavas. Brilliant flick. Took the ball early. The return was slow, but she took it early. She now leads 10-7. And then there's a heavy seven. top spin from Lee, and she nets from Cavas. And so the first game is taken 11-7. Both players taking a timeout. Cavas. Bent down, taking a drink. I don't know if that's a side of tiredness or whether she's just stretching her calf muscles. Um, Lee just stretching off a bit, taking a drink. It's Cavas who goes back to the table early, followed by Lee. Lee picks up a bat and goes to the opposite side of, side of the table. It will be Lee to serve. Second She's thrown the ball by the umpire. Lee playing in yellow. Cavas playing in red. And that went away. Oh, was Love one. It touched. It did touch. No, it didn't touch. Oh, and that's brilliant from Lee. Playing a ball down the middle after missing the first serve. She regained the composure to play a strong topspin into the backhand of Cavas, who just netted. Cavas to serve with a backhand. She serves into the backhand of Lee, who tried to play it back down the line, but didn't. And then Cavas changes serves. She comes down and over the table, and then playing wide, and that's just a very, very strong return from Lee. And it's now to all. Lee to serve. She serves. Wide into the forehand. The return on the forehand. Heavy top spin and a backhand. And then a four. Oh, and then it's wide from. She played down the. Just played off like an off forehand top spin to win the point. Oh, and a punch from Lee, and it's 4-2 now. She punches the air, lets the ball roll, giving her a bit of time. Bounces the ball on the backhand and forehand of her bat. And now she passes the ball to Cavas. Serves short, heavy top spin, but then a heavy top spin return on the forehand. Gets a clap of approval from the Chinese coach and bench. Cavas now serving with a forehand. And a heavy top spin from Cavas that's netted by Lee, just misreading the ball. A wry smile there from Lee as she misses, but she's got a forehand serve to come. Serves into the backhand, it's heavy. And then Cavas just looking a bit disappointed but she, and she calls a timeout 6-3 she trails I just don't think she's happy with the way she's playing the ball and, and she doesn't want this game to get any further away without coming back for a bit of a rest and listening to her coach she's listening intently there's a lot going off in this match but it's Lee who's actually in front So as I just show highlights of the best bits of the game so far, it will be 
Lead to serve. She Thanks leads. And the forehand return is not good enough, and now she trails 7 3. She's going to serve forehand. She serves it down the line. It's a quick. That's what I mean about the serves. There wasn't, it was just like a nice serve, nice, nice pace for, for Lee to take that ball. And again, Five Lee just acknowledging the fact that she got a net, and it's now 9 3. Serves into the forehand and then it's wide. Oh, and again she's Thank netted you. and it's rolled on the net. And the Turkey, one of the Turkey goes saying, "How come it's happening to my player?" Net. Well, three. that's the very nature of table tennis. The net is part of the game. It's now. Three. It's brilliant from Lee. She takes the second game, 11-3. And walks back to the corner, the most relaxed. There's a big Chinese contingent in the crowd. They're all waving their flags. And there's a decent crowd in to watch these, these games this morning. Um, as the morning progresses, I would expect more and more people will come in. And um, hopefully um, they'll see some, you know, they'll see some more exciting table tennis. There are more matches um, to come this afternoon. And there is a class 6 to 10 bronze medal match going on um, table 2 uh, between France and Poland that's generating quite a lot of interest as well. Serve the game. Kapasta serves. It's going to be Kavas to serve at the start of this third game. She serves into the backhand. She serves into the backhand of Lee. And it's a forehand... Forehand, she clips the net, but she acknowledges her good fortune. But she leads 1 0. Cal has to serve again. And that again, she's done a brilliant top spin, getting underneath the ball, using her legs to generate power and spin. And she now leads 2 0. And then she prepares to receive. And she served, she returned that with her backhand, Kavas. She's not confident about returning the ball with a forehand. So she goes really wide to return it on the backhand, but then she leaves the court open. And that's what happened there. And there's heavy backspin on that forehand serve then. It's now to all. Kavas to serve. Serves into the backhand, and it's down the line from Lee. Okay, now, Cal has to serve forehand. She serves it wide, and then punches the ball into the net. And it's now 4-2 to Lee. Lee in control of this game. She's not, she doesn't seem to be struggling at all with whatever Cal is throwing at her. On well, that time, she just failed to move a bit. And to get the forehand now, but um, welcome relief for Turkey as it reduces deficit to 4 3. And again, a fantastic, she plays backhand because she feels more confident. And it's now 4 all. And then a punch from Kavas as she now takes the lead 5 4 in this third game. <clears throat> and then a push off the end from Kavas. It's 5 3. China to serve. 5 3 down. Lee. Serve forehand. She serves into the middle and it's flicked. Six, and again, she's just not picking that backspin serve. Lee's coming round and down on the ball to create backspin. Cavas is putting it into a net. Oh, and then a fantastic combination from Lee. She played a backhand into the backhand of Cavas and a forehand. 
and then went in wide into the forehand and that's the one that won the point so now china leads seven five third game and that's brilliant from lee again eight five brilliant she's played brilliant all this game she stuck to her game plan she's used all the big heavy shots and it's been too much for Cavas. and again Cavas trying to take a backhand from the forehand side and got tucked up and that's why she netted so it's Lee to serve she serves into the middle again and it's taken in the middle Five by Cavas. but this time she gets the point and it's now 9-6 Lee to serve Oh, and then that was brilliant. It was it was a faster serve with backspin from Lee, right into the middle, and it came up and bounced up on on Cavas, and now she has four gold medal points, and that's it. It's the gold medal to China. They take the match, three nil. And there's a massive smile from Lee. She punches the air, shakes a coach, and. The Chinese contingent and the appreciative crowd just acknowledge the fact that China have won the gold medal. There's high fives all round. All the teams are actually just congratulating each other. I suspect Turkey will be happy with the silver. They beat Poland in the semi-final yesterday, which contains the gold medal winner, Partika. And so they suspect that they were just happy to get the... They'll be really happy to get the silver medal, although they'll be disappointed. So China take gold. Turkey take silver. Brilliant all their own performance from the Chinese. Um, they're just the runaway winners in this match. 3-0. My name's Farrell Anthony, and I will be back shortly for your second instalment of in commentary at the London 2012 Paralympic Games. Thank you very much. Well, congratulations to the People's Republic of China who've won our gold medal match this morning. Turkey takes silver. But we still have a bronze medal up for grabs. Poland and France playing a really close match on table four. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear your appreciation for our superb Paralympians. 